Hey guys, how's it going? I would do something a little bit uh, different today. So, uh, front facing. Um, got a couple things I want to show you. Uh, I got a couple books back from uh, CBCS, which was uh, my first submission. Um, pretty good experience overall. Uh, so I'm going to uh, be putting a larger order together soon, but um, uh, it got a little complicated yesterday, which I'll explain later. Um, so this was a quick pickup that I got. If you guys saw my uh, most recent haul video, I talked about um, uh, the character Star in Captain Marvel 8 and uh, um, her initially appearing in Captain Marvel number one um, as... Uh, 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 what was what was her name? I wrote it down. Ripley Ryan, Ripley Ryan, the reporter in in um, issue one of Captain Marvel. Uh, I'm specking that she is the one who becomes a star, so that could end up being a key issue. Her first appearance. Um, obviously, she's she's not uh, in costume or anything like that, so it's kind of like Cindy Moon uh, before she became Silk. I guess would be kind of the comparison, but uh, anyways. Who knows um, when, when slash if it's revealed that uh, that that was her. Um, you know, it could also be like a Ninja Turtles 51 kind of boom. So uh, we'll see what happens. But that's uh, that's what I'm specking on right now. So I did pick up a uh, copy of Captain Marvel number one. That's the uh, Alex Ross 1 in 50 variant. Um, it's only a 9.6, but uh, I got a pretty good deal on it. Um, and I figure I can at least get my money back if, if nothing happens. Uh, I mean, that being said, Alex Ross is an, one of my favorite artists, so I might just keep the book for that reason alone. Um, so uh, the CBCS books that I submitted, um, I submitted two. Um, it's a little bit cheaper in, um, Canada now to go through CBCS. They have their own, uh, uh own facility. So I, I'm going to be putting together a big, big order, I think. Um, but, uh, well, I'll show these off first and go from there. So the first book I submitted, um, I would have shown this, uh, probably a couple of years ago. This is, uh, Batman Adventures. Number 12, the Bruce Tim Fan Expo variant. Black and white virgin. Yep, yep, yep. All white. Came back a 9.8. Very, very happy with that. I figured it would, but um, being that it was my first time submitting books, uh, I was obviously a little, you know, a little bit nervous, but it worked out. Um, I, I do prefer CGC's product uh, marginally, um, but... Uh, given the added cost for me to send things down to uh, um, Florida, um, I think it's where they are, and having to go over the border and everything like that, it's just easier, especially for things that are going in my PC, to go through CBCS. And I actually, I do really enjoy their product. This one, I was a little bit disappointed on, but not too much. I had pegged this at, um, well, I'll show it first. It's Hawkman number four, first appearance of Zatanna. Really nice colors on it. But I got a three. I put this at like a 3.5. Uh, most of the issues are on the back. Uh, you can see some bit of tearing and stuff like that. Um, I didn't get these cleaned or pressed. Um, I thought about getting this one um, cleaned and pressed, but I just opted not to. Uh, just for my PC, it's, it's never getting sold, so. Um, maybe one day down the road I'll, I'll maybe try and clean it up, but either way, for now, it's just kind of going in the PC. Um, so yeah, anyways, I was going to, uh, put this big order together. Uh, I picked out all the books out of my PC, and, um, and then yesterday I came across a, uh, collection. Um, and it was all bronze and silver age books. And I bought the entire thing. 
So I'd never done that before. It was uh, 319 books altogether. And like I said, all Bronze Age, early Bronze Age, and uh, some silver sprinkled in. And, uh, well, actually, hold on. We'll just, let's go on a little, uh, let's go on a road trip. Yeah. Okay. So, it's these boxes here. And, uh... I don't know. I'm going to show these off, I guess, in detail at some point, but just as a little uh, preview. Uh, another little preview. Anyways, there's lots of, lots of goodies in here. Uh, what do we got? A bunch of Marvel team-ups. Warlock, Doctor Strange, um, yeah, I just finished uh, bagging, boarding all these and uh, putting them in my system on the computer. Uh, some more Tomb of Dracula. And the best part about this is they're all in really good condition. Supernatural thrillers. Anyways, so I don't know how I'm going to do it yet because it's, like I said, it's 320 books, so I can't do a, um, a regular haul, but uh, maybe I'll just show off the um, the key issues and, uh, and we'll go from there. So stay tuned for a um, pretty sweet uh, Bronze Age key collection haul. All right, guys. We'll talk to you later.